Hey everyone, sorry I haven't released a video in a few weeks, I'm not even going to make any excuses. But I am here now, and I'm ready to jump back in. So, without further ado... Welcome back to Free Play Arcade, the show where I find interesting games that you can play for free. Have you ever sat in a waiting room and stared at the signs and brochures? Or traced your eyes along a piece of corporate art or wood grain? Textured stucco? The Pedestrian by Skookum Arts takes me back to that kind of feeling, but in a pleasant way. I'll explain. This is a puzzle platformer where the player rearranges environment chunks and hooks them up to each other to form a clear path to the exit. The main character of the pedestrian is a stick figure, whom I can only assume is fed up with its stationary life and wants to explore the greater world. The environments are all made up of signage, like you might see on the street or in a work environment. It's a clever idea that I can easily get behind. There's a sort of Portal-esque vibe to the whole thing, in that same cold, corporate art, isolationist, impersonalist kind of feeling. The Stanley Parable had it too. I don't know, maybe I'm reading too much into it. I had a good time playing this game, although admittedly, it is still a demo for an unfinished title. I try to avoid playing demos on Freeplay Arcade, but this one just really caught my eye. Skookum Arts has been working on this game for a few years now, and they're ready to launch a Kickstarter for the finished product in January of 2017. This is a very small team of friends from Waldo, Ohio, who wanted to make something special and break free from their day jobs. I'm sure most of us could relate. I'm looking forward to January and seeing how much progress they've made to flesh out and polish the final game. If these screenshots are any indication, we could be in for something pretty special. If you're curious about giving the pedestrian a whirl, please download the free demo from skookumarts.com. It's just long enough to get a good feel for the game. And small teams like this with fun, original ideas always deserve some attention. If you like this episode of Free Play Arcade, please consider subscribing and sharing. I have new episodes every week. Also, if there are any free indie games you'd like to see me cover in Free Play Arcade, leave a comment below or shoot me a tweet. Thanks for watching.